After spending cozy days at Taylor Swift's mansion in Beverly Hills, she and her boyfriend Travis took off to New York in her private jet. They were seen early Saturday, leaving Los Angeles behind. By the afternoon, they touched down in New Jersey, where black umbrellas shielded them from prying eyes. Swift and Travis then zoomed off in SUVs back to her place in the Big Apple. By Saturday afternoon, they were back at Swift's fancy New York penthouse. Her black Range Rover was spotted entering the garage. Despite the rush of her surprise trip, Swift made time for her fans sharing smiles and waves outside her home. It seems the trip was a break from work for Swift, who's been hitting the studio hard. She's gearing up to drop her new album on April 19th, and the excitement is building. Meanwhile, Travis is swapping his football for a mic. Insiders at NatFL are buzzing about his natural talent for hosting. He's got the smarts and the laughs, one source shared. At 34, Travis is nailing it. Taylor's all for Travis's new gigs and cheers him on, though they're figuring out how to juggle their busy lives. Insiders whispered that Travis's TV deal was inked way before his fame spiked. Now, he's committed to making the show a hit without any hiccups. Travis isn't hanging up his NFL boots yet, though. He's loving the game too much to quit. Even with his packed schedule, he's chilling with Swift, and they're planning to hit Coachella together. It's gonna be epic. The couple went on a date to a secret location, or they hung out with Swift's close friends live in New York. While the pair are clearly enjoying some well-deserved time off, things are about to get busy for the famous couple in less than two weeks, Swift will release her highly anticipated album, The Tortured Poets Department, out April 19th.